guys, before I start with my very late September hits and got knows, um, I already made an entire sort of blog post on this. So if you want the full detail, go to my website, NakedTutorials.com. There will be a blog post called October Equals Insanity. October is going to be super insanely crazy. And that's because last week I was named spokesperson for hair and makeup for a TV show here in Holland, which will air in March. So for the month of October, I, um, I've been busy with We Are Agency, learning hair, teaching at Bee Academy, doing this new TV production, which is absolutely out of this world amazing. I just got called by my booker and I'm doing a photo shoot with someone so very awesome. This Sunday I'm shooting with that person. And then I'm also doing Millionacht, which is sort of like a luxe version of Deal or No Deal. And then I have my boyfriend and I have my family and uh, I have videos to make on YouTube. I have blog posts, uh, reviews to make. I have so many things to do and it's so crazy. So before I start with my September hits and a God knows, I want you guys to know that October is going to be a little bit sporadic. There's going to be videos now and then and then for quite some time nothing and then videos again and then quite some time nothing. Other than that, I am planning on doing Halloween tutorials because it's October. I'm a beauty guru. I'm here on YouTube for five years now. What I have to do is Halloween tutorials and I love doing Halloween tutorials. Halloween tutorials are one of my all-time favorite things to do. So I have planned five to seven looks to do this year. Other than that, if you want to know what my September hits that I got knows are, then please keep on watching. The first thing I'm starting with is this Catrice Made to Stay Inside Eye Highlighter Pen. And I made a full blog post review on this so you can find the link down below in the info box. This is a nude eye coal made to stay inside the eye, so on your waterline. Normally, I spontaneously use my Ben Nye Neutralizer Cream Crayons, and when I use those, I get two commons. One common is I can never find these. Where do you get them? And two is these did not stay on the waterline. So a couple of weeks ago I found the Catrice Made to Stay Inside Eye Highlighter Pen and this is a waterproof nude colored eye pen. By the way, no, I did not get my lips done. I, I know ever since I did that vlog where I was like, I want to get lip injections. People are like, have you gotten them done already because your lips look plumper? No, it's just the natural duck face I like to do on photos. Next are the MAC acrylic paints and these are all the colors I got. Um, I have to thank my good, 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 good friend Joyce for this. Joyce is one creative mother fudger. She makes the most amazing pieces. She's my personal Alex Box. She is my one of my bestest friends ever bestest oh, bestest I've always seen Joyce using these acrylic paints. I just love looking at them already because they're so goddamn gorgeous. But recently Joyce won the Public's Choice Award at the Dutch Makeup Awards and um she used some of these on her model and I just I was what is that? Joyce, what is that? Tell me. Just like she did with vanilla pigment. Ever since I saw her wear vanilla pigment on her cheekbones, there hasn't been a day I didn't wear it on my cheekbones. So now she told me about these, and oh my god, I'm so excited. I'm so excited, and I just can't hide my mm, 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 acrylic paints. I love my acrylic paints and paints. I like to kind of live on the edge now and then, so I use two colors that are not eye safe on my eyes today. So my eyeliner today is an orange eyeliner, which is red, or it's not red, it's called Basic Red Acrylic Paints mixed with Primary Yellow. So these two together make this eyeliner. Also from love, I've been, from love, I've been loving this MAC. Also from love, I've been macking this pigment. No. Also I've been loving this pigment by MAC Craw Crawled. It crawled upon me. I've been loving this pigment called uh, Basic Red, and uh, I actually have to thank Lisa Eldridge for this. Lisa Eldridge, we all know her. Love her. She did a full blog post on what makeup she used on the covers for Love magazine, and one of her models was wearing this beautiful sort of velvet matte red lip. I'm stuck with red lips, love red lips, I love velvet matte, so... Ah. So what Lisa did was she applied some Ruby Woo lipstick to her model's lips and then patted basic red pigment on top to give it that really velvet matte finish. Now this, ladies and gentlemen, is absolutely stunning. It transforms any luscious 
shiny red lipstick into a velvet mag goddess out of this world experience. For other lipsticks I've been loving this month are the Maybelline Vivids. I've been waiting so long for these to get to Holland. Um, I saw all these blog posts on American websites like, oh, these are the new Maybelline Vivids. And I was like, oh, I'm Nikki in Holland and I can't get them. So four colors arrived in Holland and we have number 910, Shocking Coral. 912, Electric Orange. 904 Wild Rose. 902 Fuchsia Flash, which is actually my favorite. So these Vivids are absolutely amazing. I love the payoff. I love the pigmentation. I love the colors. I love the finish. And if I don't like the glossy sort of finish it gives at the end, I just take a MAC pigment that is close to it just like the trick with the basic red, and then just transform it into a matte velvet sort of gorgeousness. As you could see in my Primark haul, I went to Essen, Germany, and what I cut out from that video is that I also got some beauty things. One of the things I got is my P2, and this is the Sand Style Polish in Strict. This polish right here, oh my god. I'm actually wearing it on my nails right now, but it's chipped as hell, don't judge. Don't judge. I love this color so much. It's just like a, 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 a jewel, just sparkling on your nails. And just every time you look at it, you're like, ah. From Bobbi Brown, I've been loving this blush called Pink Coral, number 31. I, I just, it's the perfect mixture between pink and peach and coral, it's like the perfect sort of mix of colors and hues and just, I love this. I love this for spring. It's great for winter when you want that, that flushy pop cheek, pop cheek, who remembers that? I've been loving my earrings, which are from Forever 21. And if you look closely, one says yes and one says no. <laughs> I've worn this to one of the shooting days for the TV show and uh, the host was talking to me and he was like, what are you thinking, Nick? And I was like, yes. And when I wasn't agreeing on something he said, I was like, no. My last hit for the month is by Classic Specs and uh, Classic Specs contacted me. They were like, we have seen you wearing glasses in videos. I was like, that's really rare. I actually wear glasses in my videos, but thank you for noticing. Classic Specs is a website where if you live in America, you can choose up to uh, six frames, sunglasses, glasses, normal glasses. You can choose six frames and uh, then you can let them send them to your home and then you can try them on. And then if you like one or two or three or four, you can buy them. But if you don't like them, you can send them back. Uh, in America, the sending back thing and the sending to your house thing is free. If you're international, that costs money. But Classic Specs was so kind to offer me two glasses so I could choose two from their website. And uh, one of them is actually a perfect fit. I ex I love it. It's called the P.O. Boy. These are really huge sort of nerdy P.O. Boy glasses. I love them. They have a really nice gray with light gray and sort of, I don't know what to do, it's charcoal. It is really big. I'm gonna go blind now. It is really big, but I kind of love going big because I feel like with glasses, uh, lately, it's not so much about wearing glasses anymore. It's about making a statement. And these are so big and so nerdy and so vintage that I love these. The Classic Specs was also kind enough to give me a promo code to give you guys $10 off of your order. And let me check. Use the code Nikki YouTube. So Nikki, N-I-K-K-I-E, Nikki YouTube on the last checkout page to get $10 off of your order. $10 will be taken off and you have $10 to spend on a vivid lipstick. Go check it out. The frames are only $89. Whereas if you go to like an optician, a frame would be like $200. So enough love spent for the month of September. It's time to spew some hall. It is time um effe hal to spuche. And now it's time for the oh god nose. Oh god! 
No. The first Oh God No this month, and it's actually from this month, October, but I'm gonna include it in September, is Rihanna's new music video, Pour It Up. I like Rihanna. I think Rihanna is cool, is edgy, she's pretty. But one thing I just do not understand about Rihanna is why is the urge for you to be different and edgy always turning out to be some kind of no. For example, her new music video, Pour It Up, I, I kind of liked the idea of her being like this big ass pimp in her chair and then with these pole dancers in the water and then twerking and twerking and twerking. It was just so ratchet. It was so no. And just her, her entire sort of outfit and hair and just, I'm kind of getting tired of Rihanna a bit because the whole MAC Cosmetics collection was kind of, it's all permanent. It's all a repromote. It's all, it's just, I'm kind of Rihanna tired. Damn girl, no. For the second all God, no, is Miley Cyrus. And I think I've said this before. And again, on to the next one. <laughs> and that's actually all the oh God knows I have. I've been really loving my life. I've been loving what what the big guy up there in the sky is throwing at me. So thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you guys enjoyed. For a full list of every single product mentioned in this video, go to my website, nakedtutorials.com. What are your hits in a God knows this month? Let me know in the comment section down below. I want to thank you guys so much for watching which truly means a lot i miss you guys and if you're already commenting on what your hits and a god knows are then please also leave a halloween tutorial request because i kind of need the help with the inspiration thank you for watching i love you i love your support i love your tweets i love your everything thank you so much and hopefully i will see you guys in the next video bye guys